Hello, my name is Ben Beckwith and this is my Fly of the Month. Hopefully it will help you catch a few more fish in the coming weeks. So my Fly of the Month for November is a popperhead minke. It's a fantastic pattern for the larger reservoirs when the fish are hunting down fry near the surface. It represents a small injured fish and the big fish seem to love eating them. So the materials we need for this fly is small olive straggle fritz with a bit of UV in it, uh, brown mink strip, small adhesive eyes and of course 7mm white booby cord for the popper. The hook I'm using is just a general purpose heavy wet fly size 8 and the thread is GSP 100 in white. So what we'll do is we'll just start the thread at the eye, wind it back halfway down and come back up. Snip off the waist. Now I've already prepared the post so I've just trimmed off and created a nice rounded end and I've sliced the bottom so it should sit nicely on the shank. A couple of turns just to get it onto the hook and then you can tighten down. Like so. Just nice and well secured onto the shank of the hook. Just put it where you want it. There we are. That's nicely tightly tied down. So just carry on all the way down. It's about the bar of the hook. Then you want to grab your mink strip. Again, I've just cut a little triangle into the end. Just makes it look a little bit more natural. Uh, you only want a small tail off the back of this. So you're just going to moisten the fur just to separate it like so and tie in on the split. So a couple of turns. Two, three. Nice and tight. Lock it in. And a couple more just to be safe and sure that it is secure. Then you're going to get your straggle. Just tie it in on the side. Make sure it's nice and tightly tied in and then come up towards the booby cord. Then you get wrapping touching turns, pulling all the fibers back each time you wrap. So you get a nice even body. Just adds a bit of color and a bit of flash to the fly. It looks nice small bait fish in the water, small fry. It's going to come over, come round and just tie that off there. Lovely. Trim off the waist and then pull your fur back. Pull it tight to the shank and tie it in. Like so and then snip off your waist piece. Just want to neaten this area up. So create a small area of just thread, pull it all back, perfect. And you're going to whip finish, like so. And trim off your waist, like that. Then get your small eyes. These just three mil adhesive eyes. Try to take them off. Place them on the new area of thread. Put a little bit of glue down to help it. on the other side. Get your eye. A little bit of glue just to help it sit right. And then gently place it on. 
inside there and just push it down with your scissors. And then what you'll then do is when that's all dried, epoxy around the head area. That'll give you a nice strong finish to your head. And that's your popper fry. So the best way to fish it in the cold winter months is to chuck it out on a floater or even on a die seven and you're just going to twiddle it really, really slowly, maybe with a couple of twitches, just to give it some life on the top of the water or again, deeper down. Happy fishing in tight lines.